Alright, this is just going to be a real quick video in which we're going to use vectors to find the distance between two complex numbers. So here I've graphed a complex number z1, which is equal to 7 plus 3i, and z sub 2 equals 2 minus 2i, and so I've graphed them both here on the complex plane, and we're interested in knowing this, this distance between them. And so what you want to do is you want to describe each of the complex numbers as a vector, find the vector that describes their position relative to each other, and then take the magnitude of that. So the position vector uh, from the origin to z sub 1 is going to be equal to 7, 3. And basically what you do whenever you have uh, the complex number z equals a plus bi, your vector is always going to be a, b. And so we have that, and then we also have z2, which is 2, negative 2. So then, in order to find the magnitude of this, we want to find this vector, so we can take the magnitude of it. And so that would be the position vector from z2 to z1, so we're going to find the vector that represents this change in in location and so we get negative 2 is equal to 5 over 5 and then we just take the magnitude of that vector and we find that the distance between the two points is 5 root 2 so Hopefully that makes sense, and that is how you use vectors to find the distance between two points on the complex plane.